Hi everybody, I want to give you a student success tip here, which is to make sure you do well on the tests in my course. Okay, so this is a college level math course. Most of your grade is going to be based on your test scores. We have four tests, one for chapters two and three, one for chapters four and five, one for chapter six, and then a final exam. Okay, if you consult your syllabus, you'll see that you know look at the percentage of the final grade it's mostly towards these tests okay so therefore um, I want you all to do well on the tests okay um, so I would like you all to get the reviews done before you take the test so if you can do well on the reviews then you'll do well on the test so for example uh, there's a chapter 2 and 3 test here. Before that, we have these reviews. See, it's 2.1, 2.2 review quiz, 3.1 review quiz, and a 3.2 review quiz, okay? So, I want you to do well on these review quizzes before you take the test. Now, you'll note that there's a, a due date for the tests. Um, and please do your best to take your test sometime. That would be great for you because then you'll be on schedule for the next chapter because remember the next chapter begins right away and you don't want to be behind schedule. However, um, you know, what's the point in taking a test on time when you're not ready? So let's say you don't get the reviews done and you maybe you miss a couple of sections as well and you're like, oh, I've got to take this test on time. You take the test on time and you get, you know, 40%. Well, if you get 40% on that test, you're probably going to fail the course. I mean, it's really going to impact your grade, isn't it? So what's the point in taking a test on time and getting a low score? There's no point. You know, do not take the test until you're actually ready for it and you you're, you're feel that you're going to pass it. You know what you're doing. So make sure you complete these reviews before you take the test. If that means that you need to take the test a day late, take it a day late. If it means you need to take the test two days late, we'll take it two days late. But Because there's really no point in taking it on time and, and not doing well. You're just going to ruin your grade for the course, aren't you? Right? So, um, so, so that's my tip of the, my tip of the day here. Um, if you need help on the reviews, absolutely get help. This is the... This is the most important time to get tutoring help from me, okay, is when you're taking um, these tests. So absolutely, um, you know, call me, uh, let's get on Zoom, let's, um, let's do some tutoring on anything you're missing on these reviews, okay? And, 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 and so, you know, my Zoom office, you click here and... Uh, yeah, so just click into my Zoom office. It's best to just give me a call so my phone rings and I know that there's a student that needs help. Yeah, okay, I'm not online, you know, 24-7. So, you know, if you click into my Zoom office, I may not be right there at that second. But if you give me a call, then I'll hear the phone ring and I'll pick it up and then I'll get into Zoom and, and help you. All right. So make sure to give me a call. Let's pop into Zoom. We'll do some tutoring and get you through those reviews before the test. And so, yeah, there's there's reviews before the chapter four and five test. Look at them here. See all these reviews. So make sure these are done before you take the four and five test. The reviews will always be similar. So if you do well on the reviews, if you, if you can do everything on the reviews, you should be able to pass the test. Uh, chapter six, we've got reviews um, here. Here's the reviews for chapter six. And what else? Uh, there's reviews before the final exam also, right? So these reviews before the final exam, all right?